gonna try it again, so. This is the bond. My man, my man, my man. In the dazzling, high-speed world of reality TV, where drama and relationships twist and turn like a roller coaster, Zell found himself caught up in a jaw-dropping revelation that sent shockwaves through his crew. Atlanta was buzzing, a city bursting with creativity and hustle, but beneath that glamorous surface, some deep secrets were about to come out. Zell, always plugged into the love and hip-hop scene, had been soaking in the tangled webs of friendship, steamy flings, and fiery rivalries all playing out for an eager audience. Still, nothing could have prepared him for the scandal involving his close friend Saucy Santana and his partner. Chef D rumors began to circulate, sneaking in like a soft breeze before exploding into a full-on storm of gossip. Zell started to hear whispers suggesting that Chef D might be cashing in on his relationship with Saucy, that T was piping hot. Folks were saying Chef D was securing financial support to keep the love going strong. The idea hit Zell hard, totally shocking and utterly baffling. He'd always noticed the undeniable chemistry between Saucy and Chef D. They were the heart of every gathering, lighting up the room with their charisma and charm. But now, this fresh gossip was flipping the narrative, casting their romance in a totally different light. Instead of a love story, it was beginning to look like a transaction, raising real questions about whether their connection was built on genuine feelings or just dollar signs. No, you don't. You negative Thanks. every step of the way. But don't go get no random girl pregnant and believe everything she's she telling you. She's not a random girl, though. Why do you have to be so we got her whole drive. Don't nobody say she nothing about nerd. you and what you got going on she or anything like that. They said she get drunk and f everybody. That's I what they said. You do too. I never heard you of You do too. Where's the fraternity head? This is my thing with you. You can meet somebody. What does it matter to you? Even if, it Even if it ain't. Even if it ain't. What does it matter to you? Why you all right? Intrigued and a bit concerned, Zell knew it was time to dig deeper. He started replaying those wild nights in his head, filled with laughter and good vibes. But now he couldn't shake the feeling that something felt off during those late night hangouts. The inside jokes and those heart to heart talks suddenly had an odd new vibe. As he sifted through these memories, it dawned on him that the flashy exterior often concealed some deep seated insecurities and fears, especially in their high stakes world. As the days passed, Zell struggled with the weight of this realization. He understood how fame's pressures could skew people's views on love and loyalty, making it all too easy for folks to cling to relationships that were, well, more about the hustle than genuine vulnerability. The idea that someone as fierce and talented as Saucy might feel the need to pay for companionship hit Zell hard. He felt a strong urge to help his friends navigate this complicated situation. One evening, as the Atlanta skyline sparkled under the stars, Zell knew it was time to confront the rumors directly. They met at their go-to lounge, a spot alive with laughter, vibrant music, and the tempting aroma of delicious food. The atmosphere was electric, but Zell could sense the weight of the conversation hanging over them, making the air thick with tension. So do you the tattoo? What you mean, what do you mean? Like, do it come with an obligation? There ain't no obligation behind me getting the tattoo. This is for me. I want to do it. You're someone who's special to me. Yeah, we've been through hella You put me through hella but I did this for me. I ain't gonna lie, I don't trust you. I mean, I, I don't trust me. Catching just the right vibe, Zell eased into the conversation with care, choosing his words as if they were gold. He shared his thoughts on Saucy's relationship, making it clear that his intentions were rooted in love and genuine concern. Saucy, Ever the charmer tried to brush it off with a laugh, but Zell caught a glimpse of doubt in his eyes. As the evening wore on, the laughter gradually faded, giving way to a more heartfelt discussion. Zell's words struck a chord, prompting Saucy to take a serious look at what was really happening with Chef D. With raw honesty, Saucy opened up about his fears of loneliness and feeling abandoned, admitting that fame's pressures had left him feeling unsteady and that he thought spending money was a way to secure loyalty. Zell listened intently, his heart weighed down with empathy. He knew that Saucy's struggles weren't unique in their dazzling world, where love could be as fleeting as a trending topic and trust often got lost in the glamour. He emphasized the importance of building real connections, reminding Saucy that true love should be grounded in mutual respect and authenticity, not money. What's that? Now, you know, just out here chilling, doing my thing. <laughs> you think anything a joke, bro? Let's see this tattoo, that's the joke. My real, what you talking about? <laughs> As the conversation went deeper, Saucy began to confront the reality of his situation head on. The idea of paying Chef D for companionship stemmed from fear, not love. He realized he'd been seeking reassurance in all the wrong ways, using money to keep someone close when what he truly craved was a genuine bond rooted in trust and emotional depth. 
With each truth that surfaced, the vibe in the room shifted, and Zell could feel a weight lifting off Saucy's shoulders as he embraced the honesty of the moment. They spent hours talking, peeling back layers of dreams and fears hidden beneath the pressure of expectations. For the first time in a long while, Saucy seemed to gain clarity in the midst of the emotional whirlwind. As Dawn painted the Atlanta sky, bringing a fresh day full of possibilities, Saucy was ready to redefine his relationship with Chef D, focusing on authenticity and a real emotional connection. He came to the stark realization that paying for companionship had only been a temporary fix, a band-aid that couldn't fill the void that only genuine love and support could. Zell felt a hopeful surge within, knowing the road ahead would be challenging for Saucy, but he was fully committed to standing by his friend on this new journey. In a world where love and convenience often tangled in a messy dance, Zell believed that true, meaningful connections could still flourish. As the sun climbed higher, bathing the city in a warm glow, Saucy began to embrace the journey ahead. He promised himself he'd confront Chef D about the true nature of their relationship, aiming to create a bond founded on honesty and emotional depth. With Zell's unwavering support by his side, Saucy felt empowered to pursue a love that was genuine, one that didn't rely on financial incentives but grew from the beautiful, messy reality of vulnerability. In the end, Saucy's journey of self-discovery and pursuit of genuine connection was set to redefine not only his relationships, but also his identity within the vibrant world of love and hip-hop Atlanta. As the drama continued to unfold, one truth stood out. When love is nurtured authentically, it shines brightest. No, you don't. You negative Thanks. every step of the way. But don't go get no random girl pregnant and believe everything she's she telling you. She's not a random girl, though. Why do you have to be so f***ing We got her whole drive. Don't nobody say she nothing about nerd. you and what you got going on she or anything like that. They said she get drunk and f***ing everybody. That's I what they never heard You do, too. I never heard You do, too. What's the fraternity tag? This is my thing with you. You can meet somebody. What does it matter to you? Even because if it ain't. Are. Even yeah. if it ain't. Damn. What does it matter because to you? Why you you think because you're Saucy Santana that you like above everybody? I don't you're think not. I'm above nothing. Thankfully, I'm, I'm the nothing. best thing that ever happened to you. Just like you're not saying that this yeah. table comes to me, bitch. Yeah. I see very much. We're not this table because of me. 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 His concern was genuine, and he knew it was time to dig a little deeper. He replayed those nights filled with laughter and good vibes, but now he couldn't shake the tension simmering beneath those late-night hangouts. The inside jokes and close talks each seemed to carry a new layer of complexity. As he sifted through those memories, it became clear that the shiny exterior often masked deeper insecurities and fears, especially in their high-stakes world. Days passed, and Zell found himself grappling with the weighty implications of his discovery. He understood that fame's pressures could twist how people perceived love and loyalty, making it far too easy to seek comfort in transactional relationships instead of embracing vulnerability. The idea that someone as vibrant and talented as Saucy might feel the need to pay for companionship hit Zell hard. He wanted to help his friend navigate this challenging situation. One evening, as the Atlanta skyline sparkled under the stars, Zell knew it was time to address the swirling rumors with Saucy. They met up at their favorite lounge, a lively spot filled with laughter, pulsating music, and the mouth-watering aroma of delicious food. The energy in the room was electric, yet Zell could feel the weight of their conversation lingering thickening the air as they waited for the right moment. Zell approached the topic carefully, selecting his words as a chef might choose the freshest ingredients. He laid out his observations about Saucy's relationship, ensuring that Saucy understood his concerns came from a place of true friendship. Saucy, ever the charmer, tried to laugh it off at first, but Zell noticed a flicker of doubt in his eyes. As the night wore on, the laughter gradually faded, making room for a deeper, more meaningful conversation to emerge. 